Enco Incorporated presents a video guide to dispersion blade assembly. We'll focus on the following four types of assemblies. First, assembly of small blades to our TS series shaft for lab stirrers or drills. Second, assembly of blades to our DS series shafts for use with any one half inch chuck. Third, blade assembly to a standard mixer shaft using our HS series adapter. And fourth, assembly of dispersion blades featuring weld-on and bolt-on hubs. Dispersion blades are sold with standard center hole sizes from 1 quarter inch to 5 eighths inch. Our TS series shafts come in 5 16 inch or 3 eighths inch diameters. Blades with 1 quarter inch holes assemble directly to the shaft with a nut. Blades with a 1 half inch center hole require our SA300 adapter, shown here, consisting of two machined discs. Our DS series shaft is 3 quarter inches in diameter with the top end turned down to fit a 1 half inch chuck. These shafts allow the user to simply bolt small to medium sized blades on the end with a 1 half inch stainless steel bolt. Disperser manufacturers often supply a shaft that is drilled and tapped at the end for bolting on dispersion blades. Our HS series adapter enables you to mount a dispersion blade on standard untapped mixer shafts. Simply bolt the blade to the adapter, then assemble it to the shaft and tighten with set screws. Dispersion blades can also be ordered with hubs for mounting to a standard mixer shaft. Our weld-on hubs are simply secured to the mixer shaft with set screws. Bolt-on hubs can be ordered when blade changes are frequent and it is desirable to reuse the hub. Like the weld-on type, it is secured to the shaft using set screws. If you need a specific hole pattern for your blade, we can provide it. Simply contact us with your requirements and we will keep your pattern on file.